I want to give you guys a sneak peek of a Raspberry Pi project that I've been working on. And in case you don't know, the Raspberry Pi is this. It's a $35 mini computer that comes from the UK. And these are very popular to integrate into maker projects, but also they're used for educational purposes so that kids can learn how to hack around with a computer without fear of breaking their home or school computers. And in fact, that's really the main purpose of the Raspberry Pi, but makers love these as well. And I think one of the strengths of the Raspberry Pi is the fact that it has video outputs on it. Uh, here's a composite video output for analog televisions, and here's a digital HDMI video output for uh, mo uh, computer monitors and tel uh, digital televisions. And I really wanted in this project to use that strength of the Raspberry Pi. And I also wanted to do a bike project. I wanted to somehow attach the Raspberry Pi to my bike. So I brainstormed with a bunch of people and came up with the idea of making a dynamic bike headlight. So it works a lot like a regular bike headlight, except that instead of just outputting a, a, a beam of light, it actually puts out information out in front of you. So using a little mini battery operated projector, I can mount that to the front of the light uh, front of the bike, hook that up to the Raspberry Pi, and have that push out information into the beam of light. And so for this prototype, I hooked up a Hall Effect sensor to the back of my bike near the wheel and put a small magnet uh, on the wheel. And that Hall Effect sensor will tell me every time the wheel does a full revolution. And knowing the di diameter of the wheel, I can figure out what the speed of the bike is. So as a first example of what you can do with a dynamic bike headlight, I have it projecting the speed of the bike out into the beam that's uh, the headlight beam. And I think there are a lot more interesting things you can do with this. Now, in case you're wondering how I, I the other kind of things that uh, are, are in play here, the Raspberry Pi is actually going to be connected to a battery uh, until I can figure out how to get uh, you know, a dynamo to uh, generate electricity for the Raspberry Pi. And um, I'm using open frameworks to do the whole thing, to do the, the visualization out in front. So what I want to do though is I don't want it just to show the speed, I want it to do other things as well. And a few ideas possibly is that if I put GPS on it, it could kind of give me a map out in front of me or maybe tell me the next cross street that's coming up so that I don't have to, you know, uh, get distracted. Or maybe it's just, uh, it can, if I put a route in, it can tell me where to take the left, to take a right, wherever. Um, but um, I think there's more that can be done. I want to have a little bit more fun with it. And this is where you guys come in because I want to get your advice and see what you think. So for right now, I want to stick with the hardware I have. That's the Hall Effect sensor, which is getting the RPMs from the wheel and the projector pointing out and the Raspberry Pi. And I want a new mode that doesn't necessarily show the speed, but is maybe a visualization of the speed in some way. So instead of just a beam going out with a number in it, what's another way that I can show something interesting, something beautiful out in front of a cyclist? Or maybe it's something that's just sort of funny? I don't know. So if you have an idea for how you would use a dynamic bike headlight and make something interesting out of, please leave a comment below. I'm going to be uh, putting all the pieces together this weekend. So I've got it working like in different sections. I've got the RPMs coming off the bike. I've got it being visualized onto a monitor. And then last night, uh, a friend of mine, uh, Ben, came out to the street with me and we tried out a projector, one of a, a 30 lumen projector and pointed it to the ground with the Raspberry Pi and we saw the results, uh, how that would look, and it actually turned out it's gonna work. I am really, really happy with how uh, good it, 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 it looked, and I'm gonna try uh, uh, this weekend with an even stronger projector to see what the results are. So let me know what you think. What would you wanna see in a dynamic bike headlight if you only knew the RPMs? What kind of interesting visualization? It doesn't have to be practical. It could be just pretty, you know? So let me know, leave a comment, um, and let me know what you think of the project generally. I think it, it should be a fun one. This weekend I'm sort of putting the whole thing together with zip ties and tape and wire, so uh, I'll, I'll maybe post another video uh, next week with how that goes. Thank you for watching these videos, I really appreciate it. Leave a comment, subscribe, send me a tweet, or send me an email, matt at mattrichardson.com. Have a great weekend, see you later, bye.